gather in for a prayer before we head out. So why don't you just quiet your hearts for a second and put ourselves in God's presence. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. We're at Bishop Grimes. We're getting ready to go to the March for Life down in Washington, D.C. Lord, we ask your blessing upon our pilgrimage as we prepare to travel to Washington, D.C. for the March for Life. We pray, Lord, that we may be joyful witnesses to life. It happens on the anniversary of the Supreme Court decision to legalize abortion. Um, so people have been organizing and attending the march since that date in 73. Uh, the ultimate goal you know, is to overturn the law and promote the sanctity of life. We pray that your gospel may inspire us to work for the most vulnerable, for the weak, for the unborn. We pray, Lord, for a shift in our culture. We pray that people may recognize the value, the dignity, the beauty of all human life. It's really you know, an encouraging statement, a positive uh, opportunity to celebrate life. So you have half a million people that attend the march every year. Um, it seldom makes the news, except for our Catholic news, of course. Um, but it's primarily young adults and teens, Catholics from across the country. Lord, we ask for your joy, for your peace to be with us. And we ask all this in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.